Good day everyone, I'm Hashel Kila and for this video, I'm going to answer four questions in our subject EL105. So without further ado, let's jump in into the video. Question number one. As a student and a future educator too, I believe that technology has a lot of things to offer. Most especially to our teachers and the students as well in the classroom. That this can enhance every student's potential and ability to different fields that they may take. And technology offers educators a way to individualize curriculum and customize it to the needs of individual students. So all children can achieve their potential, but sometimes there are techie students that aren't attentive enough to listen to the discussion. They sometimes make unnecessary things like chatting and gaming even in the middle of the class. Another thing, education technology can make learning more interactive and collaborative and that is the positive thing that technology can offer. And this can help students better engage with course materials. Rather than memorizing facts, they learn most things by doing. Question number two. With the help of technology, learners can advance his or her knowledge about the changes that may occur globally. Since technology has been a portal to many crimes and incidents, we as humans are so negative when technology was tackled. But if handled it well, it can make learners smarter and can maximize his or her potential to make him or her competent enough to deal with this ever-changing world. This can make a student more wiser in creating decisions in life. Question number three. In a classroom setting, we have different kinds of technologies and gadgets that are useful for the students and for the teachers as well. We have here laptops. We found that the laptops change classroom circumstances, making it easier for teachers to engage students in substantive collaborative project-based work, laptops also made planning and group communication easier for the teachers that we mostly observe. Another kind of technology that most of the students, or me especially as a student, observe in a classroom setting is the smart TV. Smart TV are perfect for teaching group of students, making the interaction between students high that leads to a better socialization. The obvious and most direct way teachers use educational television program is to make a connection between the show and the concept being studied in the class. Teachers often find that as they coordinate their lesson plans with visual learning, students are more likely to stay focused and pay attention, most especially when there are some pictures being flashed to the screen. Another technology that we can observe in a classroom setting is the speaker. This is perfect, most especially when you are presenting an educational video, most especially that Nowadays, students are so techy and they love to watch videos. This will make an audio more clear and presentable. Speaker device can also be used when you are trying to teach your students some Zumbas and making projects like dances. Question number four. Finding creative ways to use technology in the classroom can both make your life easier as a teacher and boost students excitement levels and engagement with lessons if you're looking for ideas on how to use this technology in a classroom well i can give you some the first one is the digital field trip this is increasingly popular and useful and cost effective for teachers most especially when you are trying to teach students some landmarks and some places that you want them to know which part of that place is incredibly amazing so you don't have to travel long and you don't have to travel uh, very far so that you can observe that. All you have to do is just sit and let the students explore those places by a digital field trip. Another one is integrate social media because students nowadays are so techy enough and already spend so much of their time on social media. Integrating its use into your classroom is among the most innovative ways to use technology in the classroom by connecting students to curriculum. 
creating a Facebook page is also one advantage of this new technology era wherein you can use hashtag so then students can easily post discussion topics or develop unique classroom Twitter hashtag or even ask questions to you privately another one is the video and multimedia lesson or presentation I believe that if you as a teacher and is techy enough and you know that your students are also in this world of technology, you need to use that as an advantage so that you can teach them so many things through and with the use of video presentations because students nowadays love to watch some visual effects, photos, videos, and put music into them. Developing slideshows could help students learn more effectively than a usual or our standard way of teaching. I think that would be all for this video. Thank you so much and God bless.